Uh, he's pretty mellow. He gets like little bursts and yeah, stuff. Yeah, he but seems pretty mellow right now. I know this is not a normal environment, but he seems really good energy right now. Yeah, he, he's learning. Yeah. He used to be a, a little bit um, like he didn't know what to do with himself now. He's calm mm -hmm. and he's kind of learned a little bit. So, um, so he just kind of... Um, he goes with our schedule. Like there's awesome. days we walk him in the morning, walk him at night, and we play with him during the day. But there's other days where we're we both go to work, and he we put the doggy video on yeah. to watch him through the day, and he just lays around and waits for us to come home. Oh, amazing! Doesn't get any trouble. Yeah, um, whatever we do. How old is he? Do you know? Five. He's five. Yeah. Um, and do you know how? Do you happen to know how much he weighs? Fifty-five pounds. He's fifty-five pounds. Yeah. He's. Um, a blocky little guy. He's reminding me of um, Dad. It's Joey. Joey. <laughs> um, he was giving me Nina vibes. He's got that block head. Um, he's he's so handsome. He's a little smiler. Um, I just love him. So he's good with the little dogs. Do we know cats? Has, do you know if he's been cat tested? Is it um, we believe no, no to cats. No to cats. Yeah, okay. He, he, he no got to cats. To see them, and when Steve was there, and mm -hmm. uh, he was pretty locked on, and yeah. had the yeah, so it's gonna like, be a no for cats. Yeah. Um, but good with other dogs. Um, how has he? Do you, do you have kids by chance? They're no, older. They're older. Yeah. Um, has he ha interacted with little kids at all? Only on walks. They want to pet him and, and everything. And he's been okay. Yeah. Okay. I mean, but he's never really been truly tested like, yeah. in a room with. Them yeah. Yeah. You would definitely need to be super aware of that just because he's never been around little kids. Um, I don't think he would be bad or anything. He just might be a little scared when little kids can be a lot. Yeah. Um, well, so he likes to play. He's learning how to play. He's been good on his walks. Yes, very good on his walks. Amazing. Yep. Um, if you're interested in meeting Joey, uh, please go to thelittlereddog.org to fill out an adoption application. Um, any questions on Mr. Joey? If you have questions um, throughout the show today, please comment them. Um, if you're on YouTube, comment. Um, if you're on Instagram, comment. On Facebook, I think you can comment too. Um, or message us and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Um, but even if you just want to meet any of the dogs that are here with us today, please go to thelittlereddog.org and fill out an adoption application. Um, you cannot meet any dogs without filling out an adoption application, so that is a must do. Um, what else, Joey? What am I forgetting about with you? You are just so handsome. I love you, yes. And he's very, um, he's very sweet and so soft. I can't get over how soft he is. Um, I'm trying, I think we covered it all. So he's, I'm sorry, you said he's five years uh -huh. old? Five years old, how many, 55 yep. pounds? Five years old, 55 pounds, good with other dogs, not good with cats. Um, and kids, we probably have to be um, weary of, but um, you told me before, which I forgot to mention too, is that um, you need to be dog experienced. Oh yeah. Um, just because you can't let him test you, you need to be in charge, strong pack leader for sure with this guy. Um, but he's awesome, and my dad loves him, and he, it's where that he says he loves a dog. So that is definitely a, a good. Um, uh, can't think of the word I'm trying to say, but testament. good testament. Thank you. <laughs> testament is what I was trying to say. Um, so again, if you're interested in Joey, please go to thelittlereddog.org. Um, thank you for stopping you by, Joey. How you found Joey. No, I didn't know. How'd you find Joey? Oh, uh, okay. Um, so my <laughs> my uh, my daughter and son-in-law um, actually um, a friend through a friend discovered that somebody was keeping him in a crate for all his five years and that's how he lived so that's why he's had no socialization yeah so they they, they talked to the guy and got him to to give him up to surrender yeah him. so we took him on um as a foster and so that's why he really didn't have any experience oh with my anything. gosh that's like, so well he's doing so well then yeah. i didn't know that that's so amazing <laughs> so, and i just love his face he's got a big old smile yes thank you so much i'm so yeah thank you that's amazing yeah. Um, yeah yeah that's one thing we always say like he he will literally stop to smell the flowers Aww. because he, he hasn't been experienced to anything but dirt for so long that he every little thing every bush every leaf he, he wants, wants to sniff to smell yeah. it. Oh my gosh, yeah. I love I love Joey even more now. <laughs> oh, that's gonna make me emotional. Um, well, thank you for all that you've done to help rescue this boy. Um, thank you, Joey, for being such a good boy. Um, so cute, so handsome. He's definitely a little pocket. 
pity cutie. <laughs> um, I'm obsessed. Um, all right, uh, we will be back. Stay tuned, you guys. We have so many puppies stopping by today with a great puppy finale. Ten puppies. Did I make that up? Some, somewhere around 10 puppies will be stopping by at the end, uh, two later. It's going to be a really fun show, um, so we will be right back.